Yo, what's going on, y'all? Make sure you follow me on Twitter at iPod King Carter. I'm always on that joint acting a fool. But uh, enough of that. It's time for the main event, man. Uh, EA Sports has been getting pressured by the entire community to make a gameplay video. Five on five, no holds bar. But to troll everyone, they come out with a gameplay trailer. So that means that gameplay must be coming soon. Um, I'm really not sure on what's the date of that. But what I do know is this game comes out November 19th. It is a next-gen only release, which means it's only going to be on the PS4 and Xbox One. Me, myself, I have pre-ordered it for PS4, paid in full, so I am expecting to grab that. Now, I want to break this thing down. So, the first thing we're going to talk about is graphics. Everybody has been, I mean, itching for this next-gen. And it looks like EA Sports has taken advantage of this with NBA Live 14. Uh, physically, the players look 10 times better than they did at E3. Um, the face wise, the face has been on a million since the first trailer that I've seen. So there's no problem there. Um, when it comes to the, the sneakers, the accessories, the jersey, the sneakers, they're okay. The accessories are very, very good. And the jersey is surprisingly good the, with the way it bounces. Now, let's talk about the presentation. Now, the arena, they should not have picked Madison Square Garden. And the reason for this is because Madison Square Garden is originally a dark arena. You really can't see into the stands like that. It's dark all around. So they kind of picked the wrong arena. Now, when it comes to the floor, the floor looks pretty good. Uh, the people that's sitting on the sideline is kind of fuzzy. So you really can't tell what's going on. You know, it's like they kind of just focused in on Kyrie Irving and left everything out to dry i guess you can say now the next thing i want to talk about is the gameplay now when it comes to the gameplay feature uh it's only one play um they didn't even finish the play it's a nice tip off um what i do see is all the players interacting with each other not just one player going around giving dap to everybody like 2k now during the tip off you see Kyrie coming down with the ball um the dribbling looks very very good i'm loving the way he was able to go through his legs and all of that one bad thing i saw was felton was still stuck in that little animation like oh man i, I dropped down defense uh he got past me okay i'll watch him get past and then i'll run after him and another thing that i saw which was pretty good is at the end of this clip him and stoudemire looked like they were about to collide when Kyrie Irving, sw like, not switched direction, but he kind of went around Stoudemire, and it looked like he was going to give a finger roll layup. So I think that's a shot at 2K with their leaning layup animation. I'm not totally sure. We won't know until the gameplay uh, actually drops, but so far, so good. I'm going to have to clap it up for EA Sports. But this is IKC signing out, and I'm going to see y'all when the gameplay actually drops. Peace. Yeah, this is Siri. Thank you for watching and be sure to like this video. For more videos from this particular mode click more videos. If you want to see more content from IKC click subscribe. Oh and don't forget to follow IKC on Twitter and to like his Facebook page. This is Siri signing out. Peace.